Hey St. Lucia, good morning. So I have to keep my voice really low. I'm whispering because we are about to sneak up on an unsuspecting KO. Yes, our very own. And he's here to tell us all about Solstice. But right now, since he's chilling, I think we better go creep up on him. Let's go see if we can make him jump. Crap! I was trying to make him jump, I guess. <laughs> I, I think I must have made too much noise. Crap. But we caught you chilling. We wanted to catch you in that moment anyways. But guys, all right, we're going to get a little comfortable and we'll jump right into all the solstice talk. All right, so enough of the monkey business. Now we're getting into the serious talk. Well, it's not going to be that serious, but we're going to keep you in the know. And solstice is back again. And, you know, really good timing because excitement is also building for the Roots and Soul Festival. And I feel like this just meshes so well with it. So, I mean, I think so too. I think it adds because, like, to the value. The Roots and Soul Festival started the same year, so the same year that solstice did. So, in a way, they've always been growing together. And it's always been my plan or my hope or dream to sort of have have the two of them grow together and have solstice as an actual part yes. of the roots and of the roots and soul festival calendar so the same way that cedar has his transcend the mm -hmm. same way your teddis and johns have their euphoria we got solstice as part of the roots it's and soul, soul season now definitely and Today. i mean like the vibes everything just fits really well mm -hmm. um so i can easily see this becoming an official fringe event part of the calendar so Absolutely. who knows what's gonna happen next so Absolutely. that means it's three years already? It's been three years. Yeah, it's been three years. We started as a, an event series that happened every Sunday mm -hmm. at Zen Nightclub. And then uh, it became a one-time special edition thing. Every time I came down, I'd do sort of a big show, bring all of my friends in to perform with me. And now we're making it an annual part of the Roots and Soul Festival. So this is for me. It, it has always been an event that fosters that, that camaraderie and that collaboration amongst St. Lucian creators, but not just St. Lucian creators, but creators all around the world, because I've done this in Toronto, I've done this in Halifax as well. Uh, it's, a, it's an environment where I take artists sort of out of their comfort zone and put them in a unique and in, in intimate environment with their fans and have them perform in a setting that takes them a little bit out of that comfort setting. For instance, I'll take like a, a Denry segment artist and I'll have him perform with jazz musicians, or I'll have a I'll have um, a soca artist perform acoustically with just a guitarist and some congas. You know, that kind of vibe. Just creating a different environment, a different mood that people here aren't necessarily accustomed to or have access to on a regular basis. So I'm excited for that because I never actually done that. I always wanted to have like my own radio show, not just to like play my own music, but to be able to like create a, a vibe that, that contributes to the culture. So we're going to be interviewing a lot of different creatives from the perspective of another creative. And we're also going to be premiering a lot of exclusive content that we have amongst all of the St. Lucian artists that we have here. Because we're always in the studio, we always collaborate together, and there's a lot of songs that we've done together that may not necessarily have a home, per se, at this point in time. You know, whoever's album or project it ends up on is whatever, but at this moment, we just have a catalog of music that we've all done together. So I figured uh, this would be the perfect opportunity to you know showcase them to the people talk about them get the feedback before we even decide to put it out so it'll be a fun experience i'm looking forward to it uh, that is going to be this friday 6 p.m to 7 p.m on blazing fm all right guys so you heard that so it means later on today at 6 p.m you tune yep. into blazing you know it's a sister company with us here so share the love and if you want a sneak peek of the feels and the vibes of sources then you know to lock in now Mm -hmm. When is the official thing kicking off? Solstice is happening on August 22nd, so that's next Thursday, right. Yeah, at Harbor Club. My goal for Solstice from the very beginning has always been to elevate that experience while maintaining that same level of intimacy that it's known for. So Harbor Club seemed like the perfect partner to elevate that experience while maintaining that, that intimacy. So it's going to be in the Harbor Club ballroom. The stage, I don't want to give away too much, but it's going to be a vibe. The stage is going to be in the middle of the room and people are going to be able to be around us as we perform so oh, wow. yeah it'll be a uh, uh, it'll be fun I, I we got we're pulling out all the stops we're making sure the sounds right we're making sure the artists are ready we're making sure everything is copacetic for solstice so you can expect a lot of 
the the usual suspects, if you will, as far as Solstice is concerned, because I consider them family. You know what I mean? So you could expect Smalls there, you could expect Infinite there, you could expect Cedale there, my brother Rashad Joseph, among many others. But I also have a lot of special guests who I want to keep as surprises. So as we continue to roll out content for Solstice over the course of the next week, you'll start hearing a little bit more about the artists who are going to be part of it, the musicians who are going to be part of it, as well as the, the official partners and sponsors that we have with Solstice this year. All right, so if people want to stay informed and know all the latest updates as we count down to Solstice, mm -hmm. where's the best place that they do that? Follow us on social media. You can follow me on KO Music underscore, and you can follow Sol the Solstice page at Solstice758. That's S O U L S T I C E 758. You get all the exclusives, all the info, all the updates you need right there. So, yeah. St. Lucia, mm -hmm. if you've not been, and this is year three, I don't know where you're at. This is the time to make sure you come out and be part of it, be part of the family. And it's a different vibe because you feel connected with the artists, those you know, and even those that are undiscovered, and you will discover them there. So I want to thank you again thank for you so much. chilling. Thank you so much. Lots of new music, too. It's I'm excited true. about that. We're also going to have a single. I'm releasing a new single the day of Solstice. Um, so that'll be fun as well. We'll be premier um, performing a lot of new music. Uh, the band is incredible. So, yeah, I'm, you can tell I'm just, I'm beaming right now. I'm excited. Make sure you get your tickets now. Uh, tickets are available at the cell. And you can hit us up on our social media pages, Solstice 758 or KO Music underscore, and we'll come to you. All you know? right. So. so you can't get it any better than that, people. So at least we're going to make it a lime. You're going to feel the vibes. So it's Solstice for 2019. So mm -hmm. where are you at? Yep. <laughs> Good morning, good people. Wake up and get ready to be in the know with us as we are excited and we are preparing for the Roots and Soul Festival for 2019. So we had to come to Maneva. Of course, she's going to speak on behalf of an events company. So Maneva, I know you're excited. I'm excited. How are you? I am thrilled. <laughs> Exhausted too. I mean, but it all comes with it. Um, it's just so much going on, getting ready. It's our third installment of the Roots and Soul Festival. And of course, every year the expectations rise That's right. you know people want more and so everything that we're doing of course we endeavor to put together a more amazing package every mm -hmm. year and so I feel confident that we have um, it's a buzz out there everybody's talking about Roots and Soul well the, clearly because yes. the ticket sales are doing very well we're very very excited um, the lineup is amazing and there's just so much going on you know it's like a roots and soul fever that is one of our that is a priority really for the events company of St. Lucia and the government of St. Lucia as well to ensure that our national talent whether they're here residing with us mm -hmm. or they're over there overseas somewhere in one of the diasporas um, to bring them back home and this year we're very excited to see a lot of that happening mm -hmm. it's happened but even more so um, for we have the Friday event which is on the 23rd at the ramp on Rodney Bay it's 90% um, St. Lucian I dare to say maybe 95% St. Lucian you have Kamaya Lizette um, amazing personality I've been speaking with her over the oh, last so few dynamic. days so dynamic and so special um, performance poetry is her game and she's bringing it and she's bringing an A game and she's been on the ground for a while now um, in fact today we do have happening at Miku at the Miku Public Library mm -hmm. uh, performance and um, poetry workshop hosted by Kamaya and the events company of St. Lucia. We're just very happy to be involved. She's allowed us the opportunity to go home with her to Miku. Um, so, you know, I'll be going down there shortly <laughs> and um, just, just giving her the support. And she wanted to take it there. She wanted to, to meet with the, the young students in her community and, and help teach them about performing arts. And, and she is qualified. She's a qualified actress. So it's good to see her come back home and want to give that to us. Um, we also have a second work workshop that she's going to be hosting and that is on the 22nd Thursday the 22nd um, of, of August at the Bay Gardens Hotel and so again we've had registra registration just flying in for this um, we have limited seating we have to say um, and it is it is 11 to 18 and even older she said to me Miniva you know what 
anyone who's interested in performance poetry and 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 um, um, lit, 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 literary um, skills, let them come. I don't. It doesn't matter about the age. So as young as as old as, if you're interested, then you're invited to come. And you can simply just email me at ecslpr at events St. Lucia. So that's E V E N T S S A I N T L U C I A dot com and let me know if you're coming so we can tell Kamaya who to expect. Mm -hmm. But um, there's all of that happening around that. And going back to Friday, we have Asha Small, yes. um, who is a St. Lucian. We have as well um, Naomi Grandison. I'm looking forward to seeing that's Naomi. I'm so champion. proud of her. Yes. She's she's so special. Um, and they're backed as well by local musicians like Daniel Daniel and his team. So just to feel each of them is special. Then we, when we move on to the, the weekend, the weekend is exceptional as well oh, yes. um, because we have Showing Dupes Prize, who is St. Lucian. We have Zamani, who's on Sunday. Zamani and Showing are both on Sunday. And um, Zamani has St. Lucia, St. Lucian roots. Ooh, Her right. father is Harvey Miller. Um, and just talking to Harvey over the yes. last few days, he's so proud of her. But of course, she's also proud to be coming back home and she's looking forward to performing for her St. Lucian family. So we're looking looking forward to that. And then on the Saturday, of course, we have Skip Monday. Yes. Skip Monday is one of my favorite local groups. Yeah. They're different. They're yes. they're they're exciting. Um, it's just electrifying when you look at them perform, you listen to their music. Yes. It's it's uh, it's it's how they've taken what they they've pulled from world music and just brought it and fused it with our own style of music. Yes. And so I'm looking forward to all of that. So we have so much going on. I mean you could tell I'm just it's I'm buzzing, I'm excited, I'm happy because I know that so many people are just excited for Roots and Soul. We've made it affordable. So, yes. you know, and, and that's the thing. We've run some amazing specials. Um, so, but the tickets at regular prices are even affordable. Yes. So you have on Friday, it's 75 EC dollars for a pack show. And then you have Three Canal who finish oh. everything off. No, um, so <laughs> they've, they've been blowing up social media. Um, so, you know, far and wide, we know persons are coming out to see that. And it's 75 EC at the ramp on Rodney Bay. The ambience there is just so spectacular. And of course at Pigeon Island, each of those days is 150 EC dollars for a pack showcase. And on Saturday, of course, you have as well Lee John and Taris Riley featuring yeah. Estelle, you know, and, and then on Sunday we go back to Genuine and Maya um, and UB40, mm -hmm. 150 EC dollars. Yeah, that's Listen, a steal of a deal. Uh, it's a steal of a deal. <laughs> um, and on top of that, we've, we've padded that on with added value packages. If there are 10 of you, get a group of 10 friends together and say, guys, we want to come. Let's buy a group, group package. You get 10% off 10 tickets plus. You really want to do that. I hope you're listening. You really, really want to do that. Um, and then on top of that, we have the uh, most amazing VIP experience, Roots and Soul VIP experience. And it is going to be something fun and and special for the royals so if you believe your royalty then you really want to do vip with us because um you're talking about priority packing when you get there mm -hmm. uh, a shuttle a luxury shuttle that takes you to the event mm -hmm. a meet and greet at the gate with a welcome drink and a special wristband you get ushered to your to your 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 your, your the tent um to our vip experience um area lounge um you get amazing food I just hope I get to have some of it. Um, and then on top of that, we are thrilled to announce that we have PCD who's joined us. And they're bringing along with them Siroc and Hennessy. And it's a premium bar, all-inclusive, 300 EC dollars. I mean, 300 EC dollars for all of that. I mean, if you've not picked up your VIP experience packages yet, you really want to do that and I know a lot of people have been calling us VIP please yes VIP is covered VIP experience and we're bringing it tickets are available well online at eventsinglisha.com so you can go there and purchase if you don't want to leave your desk mm -hmm. but if you're out there and you want to pick up your ticket you can go to Steve's Barbershop thank you Steve thank you Steve <laughs> um, he's just so loyal so brilliant going to that barbershop he has tickets there and of course the sell outlets um, and you can feel free to call us here as well if you're buying that group package actually if you want to take advantage of any of the special offers just come to us at Events St. Lucia we are based in the Shoreline building at Vidbute which if you're heading north if you're heading southbound it's right after Renekin Company, um, so and it's where the St. Lucia Tourism Authority used to be before. Usually, we give these descriptors because people, you know, these directions because people want to know where is your office. Mm -hmm. We're right there at Vidbute. We're not far away, so you could come by and yeah. 
vibes. You Speak can't miss us. the building, trust me. Very vibrant color on the stretch. You will not miss it. Yeah. And it says Shoreline on it. So. Yes. So I'm about to head to Miku. And if anybody wants to join me down there Hello. at the, the, the public library, I'm really excited to see what Kamaya has in store for, for the students down there. And of course, again, like I said, she'll also be at the Big Gardens on Thursday. That is the 22nd. 22nd. And it's from 9 a.m. to 2 p.m. Mm-hmm. Right? Please call us or email us at ecslpr at eventsimplusha.com if you want to be part of that. All right. Well, good stuff. St. Lucia, I know where you're heading. We might just tag along to Miku as well, too, guys. So you know what? Make sure you're there and return so August 22nd through to the 25th. 23rd to the 25th, yes. Oh, no. You well, know, I, well, you're talking about, if you yes, want to start what? the workshop, guess what? So we're starting it's started there. already. That's it right. It's started already. Technically, we are there. All yes. Right. So we'll see you there. And just like that, we made your Friday the best one ever. So thank you, of course, for being part of our family here at DBS. And right now, there's so much to do on the weekend. We are looking forward to Roots and Soul. The countdown is on. So guys, whatever you decide to do, live it up. Life is short, so enjoy every single moment. And of course, make sure that you come back to us because each and every day, Monday to Friday at 6 a.m., we will make sure that we wake you up in the know and deliver all the good vibes that you need. So until then, I'm Chayla Mendes telling you, be good. Have fun in my honor, and I'll see you next time.